out of these four options which is the best output of this program execution of a python program starts at the main function so variable n points to 1 similarly variable val points to 12 assignment operator means right hand side assigned to left hand side random dot ran range 0 comma val variable val contains 12 so ran range 0 comma 12 returns a random integer between 0 and 12 minus 1 0 to 11 so here you get a random integer between 0 and 11 now in order to find the output of this variable here many values are there so taking each value one by one and calculating the output of this variable is time consuming hence when many values are there what I mean by many is when more than three values are there you can apply a special method take the smallest value calculate the lower bound of this variable take the largest value calculate the upper bound of this variable and this variable contains all the integers between lower bound and upper bound so what is the smallest value available here 0 so 0 multiplied by 1 it is 0 and 8 plus 0 it is 8 so for this variable the lower bound is 8 now let me calculate the upper bound of this variable take the largest possible value here it is 11 so 11 multiplied by 1 you get 11 and 8 plus 11 19 so for this variable the upper bound is 19 meaning this variable may contain integers between 8 and 19 now in order to calculate the output of this while loop variable r and d contains many values more than three values are there so you take the smallest value of this variable calculate the output you take the largest value of this variable find the output while loop variable n points to 1 variable r and d smallest value it is 8 now 1 less than or equal to 8 condition true so print n in the computer's monitor you get 1 n is equal to n plus 1 so n is 1 1 plus 1 2 so now your variable n points to 2 now 2 less than or equal to 8 is correct so print n in the computer's monitor you get 2 n is equal to n plus 1 n is 2 so 2 plus 1 3 so now your variable n points to 3 now 3 less than or equal to 8 again condition true so print n in the computer's monitor you get 3 and this continues so here you get all the numbers from 1 to 8 so when I select the smallest value of this variable that is 8 I get all the integers from 1 to 8 so if I select the largest possible value of this variable which is 19 I get all the integers from 1 to 19 out of these four options it is better to select option number 4 1 to 8 as the correct answer because if you select 1 to 8 as the correct answer there is guarantee that always these numbers are part of the output why always these numbers are part of the output because if I select 8 the answer is 1 to 8 if I select 9 the answer is 1 to 9 if I select 19 the answer is 1 to 19 so numbers 1 to 8 are always part of the output hence out of these four options it is better to select option number 4 which is 1 to 8 as the correct answer of this program